Yo, what is up you guys, Lillian here, back at again another video, this is part 11 of The Last of Us Part 2. In the last part we did encounter a new enemy type, which uh, was the Shambler I believe, yes. And we're continuing right off from where we left off with that, hopefully there's not any more of those. Looks clear, <clears throat> as far as I can see. Good. Ooh. Almost walked right past this. Shamblers? If the others weren't bad enough. Man, guess that's nature for you. Yeah, well, nature's an asshole. She got that right. Hey. What's in here? Oh. Okay, that's weird. It spawned us back here. I'll just skim over this area real quick, I guess. I already know where everything is, anyway. I think it didn't save properly, that's why it had us back here, I guess. Because it is being captured literally the very next day after, you know. The latest part you guys just saw on Friday, so it's a bit weird about the save file, I guess. Anyway, what's over here? Oh, that's right, we have more, what you call it? Yeah, that's right, I'm still waiting on the endurance here. The code is 152 dot dot. I didn't necessarily need to collect that can, but I figured I'd do it anyway. Let's see. Only because I couldn't remember the code properly. What was it? One five two four three, I think. Yes. Okay. How'd you do that? Magic. You're my favorite. <laughs> For some reason I thought I was gonna get that wrong. Well, be a bit of laugh on me if I actually did get it wrong. Literally, when I got it right the first time in the last part. Okay, that looks like everything. Let me get this last, uh, yeah, endurance, otherwise, lethal damage, or instead leave you at low health, giving you an opportunity to escape. Yes, I want to max that out. Eh, and I got an achievement for that too. Specialist. There we go. Okay, that should be everything in here, right? Just to be safe, I'm gonna look around here real quick. Yeah, I already looked in there. Yeah, let me swap weapons real quick. Scissors. 
Okay, that should be everything then. I like this prone though. It's actually really useful. Not as useful as, you know, in large enemy areas, but... At least useful enough to where you can hide in like, really short grass. Uh, there's an opening down here, but I don't know if that's the way we're supposed to go. Hmm. There must be a way around. I like your optimism. Eh. Okay, so I was right in the money there. Eh. I literally came over here just to see if there was anything over here. I. Didn't really think that there would be something there. Shit. Shamblers. We got this. I don't care if infected see my flashlight or not. All I know is I'm not getting blown up. Dang it, I thought that would work too. I didn't even realize right there that they saw me. I'm ready to get out of here. Same. That went from zero to a hundred real quick. Water. Okay, so I used up what little shotgun ammo I had. Oh, uh, because I see like them like B 
being the only really effective way to get rid of the shamblers. But I probably shouldn't have used that, you know, short distance. I mean, long distance. Anyway. There's some more rifle ammo right there. Hmm. Literally realized right there and then that I had my shotgun equipped. It's more effective to show up. I would have fired my shotgun instead of my actual pistol. Just double check in here before we leave this area here. Wait, what is that? Hmm. I guess that was it. There we go. This is cool. Huh. Okay, let's check what's over here. See if there's anything over here though. Nothing. I always gotta check the most unlikely places. There's always like a scratch of like ammo or something. I'm gonna say some kind of train crash. Thanks, Sherlock. Uh. Is that door? Yeah, okay, so that door you can't even go through. I thought that could be another way out, but I guess in this train's the only way then. Anything over here? Nope. Is that a bottle? Uh, okay, so we have a bottle already. Jesus. I wonder how long they kept these running past outbreak day. Mm. There's an it's opening right way. there. Up we go then. Okay, are we supposed to go this way or not? Because there's a door right here. This looks like the way up. Okay, I guess not. Hmm. <clears throat> no, I'm checking this out real quick. Who is this first aid kid in here? We got here. Best, best Easter. 
Bastin, Bastin, I think, real name unknown, Brain 60, Braun 60, affiliation of new dogs from Dr. Erdmick, pulled an anonymous teen girl off the streets of Kyo. He got more than he bargained for originally intending to use her for his human genetic enhancement project. Things went awry when the imp, the IMP introduced cat DNA into the mix. Now gifted with the agility, visions, and predatory instincts of a cat, the girl took on the name of Egyptian cat goddess Bastin. Clever and malicious, she acts as one of Erkman's enforcers, using her skills for a high, high risk heist, but even the brilliant Erkman can't tell where her allegiance truly lies. Neutral villain. A neutral villain? That must be the first one we've actually gotten that's a neutral villain. And say, you know, like, an actual, like, hero or what? That is weird, though. Okay. Anything down here? Yes, there is. Okay. Getting closer to light. Anything over here? No, there is not. Alright, let's see here. Okay. Hey, let me get you up there. Yeah. <coughs> what you got? <coughs> oh, come on. Okay. Let's rally. We're almost out. Lead on. Go, 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 go. Ellie, right here, don't slow down. Come on, come on, come on, come on. This way, hurry. Fuck, go right. Come on. Oh, dang. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, oh, oh. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, dang, man. Dina! Man, that guy went south so quick. Hey. What do you 
say we rest in that theater. <sighs> that sounds so fucking good. Hey. Almost there. <clears throat> I got you. Here. Got it? Dang, Ellie. You want to tell me what's going on with you? What's going on with me? Ellie, I just saw you breathe spores. I told you. And you didn't believe her. I'm immune. Okay. You're immune? Come on. I was bitten a long time ago. The fuck are you talking about? I was bitten and nothing happened. The chemical burn. Maria and Tommy and Joel are the only ones who know. Now you know. Yeah, that's a lot for her to take in. I can't get you infected if that's what you worry about. Hmm. I can't make you immune either. supposed to do now nothing I just need to rest for a second Are you fucking kidding me? how long have you known <sighs> it was late a few weeks ago a few weeks we could have we could have still turned back well, I didn't know <sighs> I wasn't sure okay I didn't want to be a burden well you're a burden now aren't you Make sure this place is secured. You just rest. Okay. Didn't expect that. Is quite the twist, to be honest.
I see where Ellie's coming from, but still. That was kind of a bit rude, to be honest. Fucking pregnant. How could you keep something like that? Uh. Uh, let, let me check over here real quick. Anything else? Mm, no, I don't think so. Dang, someone must have been chilling here. September 4th, me, Pez, Green, and Adams made it to the listening post two days ago, and so far, so good. WLF haven't come looking here yet. The city's lost to the WLF. We escaped headquarters. Our shield looking good timing. Tours, Wood, and the others are probably dead. Camping here. Grateful to be alive for now. September 6th. Can't sleep. Burning up with a fever. No medicine. Looked everywhere. We don't have anything except the uniforms on our backs. No contact from... Anyone on the radio either. How many of us made it out? September 7th, still feverish, don't have any big cuts, but probably not an infection. The others are waiting until nightfall, then making a run to the hospital to get medicine for me and supplies for wherever we're going next. They're good guys. September 7th, I mean September 10th, shouldn't be taking this long. Hmm. Okay, this note's old. Better be careful. Anything else in here? Hmm. More tape. Hmm. Still no. Her being pregnant kind of took me off guard. Like, I didn't expect that kind of little, like, twist right there. For a second, I thought, wait, Ellie, what did you do? <laughs> but I was like, wait, Ellie? Uh, I'm not going to go into that. I'm not going to follow that train of thought. Thank you very much. Beyond. Real name Emma Graves. Brains 80. Bronze 40. Affiliation none. After a near death experience that left her in a coma for two weeks, this seasoned detective found that she could cross from our world to the spirit world, allowing her to communicate with the dead now known as Beyond. She splits her time between solving murder investigations and serving as a spiritual medium for green families seeking closure. However, her forays into the spirit world are clearly hastening her demise she looks considerably older than her 35 years how much longer does she have beyond dang that sucks that is like the most worst power you could ever have like yeah you can use it to communicate and you know help grieving families but still to accelerate one's life, I, I get if it's for a good cause, but still, it seems kind of like a real old slap in the face right there. Ooh, there's all kinds of stuff in here. What else we got here? Oh, is this another radio? Right now, let's see here. September 13th. They're not coming back. Either got ambushed or they ditched me. Not my fault I got sick. At least the fever's gone. But now I'm effing starving. We'll probably raid the buildings nearby for food to see if I can raise someone on the radio. September 15th. Constant rain means I at least won't die of thirst. Unfortunately, it keeps making the electric cord out. The electric cord out all the time. Makes it kind of hard to use the radio. Not. 
like anyone's answer in any way, the WLF haven't hit all the F E D R A listening posts no way need to keep trying September sixteenth. Dreamt they were laughing as I slowly bled from a gut shot. Woke up an hour earlier, still shaking. Need a cigarette? You'd think there'd be a pack or two stashed somewhere in the effing theater, but apparently not this one. S September 19th. Power went out again. Going to head to the roof to see if I can get it back on. Hmm. Huh. Need to get the power going. Hmm. Oh, I didn't even see these right here. Anything else in here? Okay, let's go check out the roof, I guess. Okay. Oh, dang, man. You weren't much of an electrician. Now nah, he got blew up right there with all that char right there. Shoot. Hopefully that doesn't blow up the place. Uh, that should be fixed. Staying, he got blew up by the electricity anyway. At least we know what happened to him. Yep, we got power. Let's see what we got here. What's this? Alright. Mm -hmm. Okay. At least they have power now. That's good. I'm still deciding on what game I'm going to be doing for the live stream on uh, next week. As well as still deciding on the day. I will be probably posting this Saturday or Sunday on my Twitter. The exact time frame for the actual live stream. So... Wow. Have you guys look forward to that? Yeah. You love watching a movie in this place. Mm. Dang, you can still hear it up there. Eesh. Uh. Uh, this 
Spooky. <sighs> no way. What? Another guitar. Yeah, it looked dusty. I'm probably gonna get copyrighted for this again. YouTube's a big old stickler for the actual uh, rich call here. I could just talk over that, but you know, it just. I really like this song though. At least the, you know the sound I still like that Three years ago. That storm sound like something. Oh, I suck. Hey, Joe. Yeah, this is that's all. Yeah. All right, come on. Is it? Yeah. Oh shit. <laughs> I'm gonna start guessing. You want to spoil your surprise now? I don't know. Is it a dinosaur? Stop trying to guess. I ain't telling you. <sighs> All right. Is it an elephant? <sighs> Is it a convertible? You're not Fair. Guess. Is it a puppy? Is it a lot of kittens? You mean a litter? What's a litter? A bunch of kittens. Bleh. Mind your step. I got it. Oops. Ah! Ooh. <laughs> You should see your face right now. What if I drown? No, you're not gonna drown. You gotta work on that confidence, kiddo. <laughs> yeah, keep laughing, old man. Let's see what happens. <laughs> this way. It's worse. Your swimming's getting better. Remember now, don't just flail about. You gotta. Push the water with your whole arm. Blah, blah, blah. Glad to know I'm getting through. This she was taught how to swim. See it? See it? Where? Just through there, look. Yeah. I see it. Yeah. Looks like. <laughs> How's that feel? Uh, refreshing. Yeah, it's not nice getting pushed in. <laughs> well, actually, we need to swim through this part anyway. I got you back. You're angry and upset. I am very angry and upset. Now come on. <laughs> We're gonna need to dive under here. Take a deep breath. Yeah, I got this. Is it my 
sixth grade history teacher wanting to apologize for being a massive dick? <laughs> Beg your pardon? My friend and I would argue whenever he called the Fireflies terrorists. We got a lot of detention. You know, you really need to stop letting people wow you up. It's hard when they're dicks. Point still stands. <laughs> right, got another dive over here. Where are you taking me? Uh. <gasps> it's nice that we're actually getting these flashbacks of Joel. Is it a new pair of sneakers? How many of those do you have? Not enough. Fuck it. I'm done guessing. Well, good. But, like, is it a massive comic book collection? No, wait. A new DVD collection? <sighs> yes. That's a, which one? Just. Yes. <laughs> I heard that's a thing. They would still have laser discs in this universe? I doubt it. This is 25 years in the apocalypse. You ain't gonna find a pristine laser disc just sitting around. Especially when the thing's the size of a freaking saucer. Ooh. Shit, Joel. We're here. Oh my god, it is a dinosaur! And it is. Joel! Surprise. Holy shit. Oh. <laughs> Some motherfucking dinosaur. Uh. King of the tyrant lizards. That's a big boy. It's a big boy, all right. He a big boy. <laughs> uh. But anyway, we are going to stop here for now. Kind of don't want to leave this flashback, but we'll tackle it in the next part. Uh, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and follow me on Twitter to find out the time for the live stream. As I will be posting either Saturday or Sunday of this, this coming weekend anyway, of this video being posted. But anyway, like I said, be sure to like and subscribe. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.